Hey guys, this is Ujjwal from RawDextra.org and I have the OnePlus One with me today that we are going to root and it's running the latest Cyanogen OS 12 that is the Android L update or the Android Lollipop update that was supposed to be released by Cyanogen for OnePlus One and as you can see this is based on Lollipop and it's running Cyanogen OS 12 and we are going to root it in this video so this step actually requires three things that you should do that is one unlock the bootloader two apply or install a custom recovery like twerp on the oneplus one and three finally rooting the device so it can be quite uh, complex for new users so this is why i am going to uh, do all three of those things in the same video my oneplus one is actually already un bootloader unlocked and also i have installed twerp on it which is a custom recovery but i'm going to do it all over again so that you guys can see how to do it from scratch so without any further ado let's start So first of all you have to visit the first link that I have in the description of this video and it will be the tutorial of how to root oneplus one running Cyanogen OS 12 on the blog. Now you have to do download a few things to start. First of all we are going to unlock the bootloader and we will be needing the ADB drivers that are needed to unlock the bootloader. So just go to this post, find the uh, unlock bootloader section in this post download the ADB drivers it will take you to this page just go ahead and download the drivers it will direct you to a Mediafire page download it and extract it and save it at a safe place we are going to need this folder and the contents inside so moving on to how to unlock the bootloader use the official oneplus one USB cable so that you don't face any type of problems now first of all in your device let me focus just a second i guess it's in focus first of all in your device go to settings in about phone tap the build number seven times actually and this will enable developer options we need this and go ahead and turn on android debugging this is needed and this is why we are going to need the uh, ADB drivers. Now connect the, I guess it's USB debugging. Anyway, just find the option and turn it on. Uh, so now just connect your OnePlus One to the PC using the USB adapter. It will open up on PC as you can see. Uh, now. I told you to download the ADB drivers folder. Open it up. I have it saved already on my disk. Just a second. So there it is. We have all the contents that we are going to need. Keep the shift button on your keyboard pressed. The shift button pressed and then right click. You will see a open command window here option. Click that. This will start a command window that is directed in this directory now all we are going to do is type adb devices this will start the adb server on your computer and it will interact with your device here now you have to click ok on a prompt that your phone shows just tap ok and type adb devices again and press enter this will now show the device that is online. We need this. Now, before unlocking the bootloader, let me tell you that unlocking the bootloader will totally wipe your device. All your data, contacts, settings, even the internal storage will be wiped. So make sure you take appropriate backups. Uh, you have been warned. So now just type in ADB reboot 
bootloader into this command prompt and your phone will boot in fast boot mode here you can see fast boot mode now just type fast boot OEM unlock this will unlock the bootloader of your oneplus one your device will be totally wiped it might take some time but mine was already unlocked so it didn't take any time now just after the process is complete just uh, type fast boot reboot you'll find the commands in the link that is in the description of this video this will reboot the device to android system wait for it to boot up properly and we will come back after the device boot is complete as you can see the device has completed the boot and it is actually optimizing the apps we will come back when the process is complete alright so you can see that the boot has been completed now and we are going to quickly go ahead and set up the device we are not going to set up any uh, Wi-Fi networks or anything I don't need it now I just need to uh, turn on USB debugging again we will need it for flashing the recovery and here we go okay so after the boot is complete just go in the settings go to about phone tap the build number seven times go to developer developer options and turn on android debugging and turn off update cyanogen recovery so we have turned on android debugging and turned off update cyanogen recovery now we are going to uh, connect the oneplus one with the pc again and as you can see it will ask for the USB debugging permission again just tap OK and you're good to go while your oneplus one is still connected to PC just type EDB reboot bootloader and press enter the oneplus one will again reboot into boot, fast boot mode now go ahead on this page this section actually deals with installing custom recovery on oneplus one so move to the next section you'll see uh, that we have the installed twerp on oneplus one section here go to the first link in this section and download the twerp latest twerp image from here it's about 9.9 .9 mb the size will be mentioned on the same page itself we have already downloaded it so we are not going to download it again it's in this folder adb drivers folder that i told you we will be using now rename the image from anything that is currently named to recovery.image.img go back to the command prompt and type fastboot flash recovery recovery dot img it will take some time and it will flash the recovery now that twerp has been installed we are going to type fast boot reboot this will reboot the phone and as you can see the oneplus one is being rebooted all right so two out of three steps are now complete and we are good to go now again go to settings while the system is on go to settings then developer options then look for an option named advanced reboot basically what this does is provides you more options in the reboot menu so after tapping the reboot menu you will have the options that read uh, these options that include recovery and bootloader as well so just tap on recovery and tap ok this will boot the phone directly into recovery 
all right guys so no, now that we are in work we are just going to transfer the downloaded files from this page you have to download a file from the section of routing from this page and then transfer it on your phone uh, the one plus one and then tap install go and flash the cmos 12 root zip it will take a second or two and it will reboot the system now let me come back after the system has completed the boot all right guys the system has now booted we are just going to go into the settings go to the privacy section here and make sure the privacy guard is on by default you just have to turn it on if it is off now go to home i have downloaded an app named root, root checker to check the root access just open it up tap on verify root now you can see it will ask for your permission just tap allow and as you can see the device is rooted so this was all in the process of routing the device the oneplus one running cyanogen os 12 so this was quite a long procedure but totally worth it and thank you for watching guys this was a small procedure if you like this video video just click the like button below and subscribe to my channel i'll be posting more such tutorials and stuff so thanks for watching guys have a nice one